Hi everyone, today's headlines. Despite Dengue wars, Durga Puja festivities light up Dimapur. Kargi writes to Prime Minister Narendra Modi over politicization of bureaucracy. Governor visits Durga Puja pandals in Dimapur and Kohima. Naga woman yet to break glass ceiling in construction sector. NSN IM stresses truth in historical connection. News in details. Despite Dengue wars, Durga Puja festivities light up Dimapur. Despite an unprecedented increase in dengue cases this year, the Durga Puja celebration continue undeterred in Dimapur and neighboring district with colorful pandals and enthusiastic revelers taking part in festivities. While the mood may be slightly damped compared to previous years due to dengue outbreak, Durga Puja committees and devotees alike stay determined to uphold traditions and festive spirit. According to the president of Dimapur Bengali Students Union, Dibangar Sarkar, Durga Puja which symbolizes the triumph of good over evil has been damned a bit this time and there are fewer people in the market and at various pandals compared to the previous year's celebratory mood. Kargi writes to Prime Minister Narendra Modi over politicization of bureaucracy. Congress President Malikarjan Kargi on Sunday wrote to Prime Minister Narendra Modi alleging that the government's recent orders asking officials to showcase the achievements of the last nine years was politicization of the bureaucracy and demanded their withdrawal. In his letter, Kurgi objected to the government order issued on October 18, which he claimed stated that senior officers of ranks as high as Joint Secretary, Director and Deputy Secretary are to be deployed to all 765 districts of India as Rat Prabharish to showcase achievements of the last nine years of Government of India. Governor visits Durga Puja Pandals in Dimapur and Kohima. Governor of Nagaland L.A. Ganeshan on Sunday visited various temples and Durga Puja Pandals in Dimapur and Kohima on the auspicious occasion of Durga Puja. In Dimapur, the Governor offered Puja at Sitla Mata Temple near railway station Rajbari Durga Puja Committee and PWD Durga Puja Committee an update from PRO Raj Pavan stated. In Kohima, Ganeshan attended the Kohima Bazar Durga Puja Committee opposite head post office. Naga woman yet to break glass ceiling in construction sector. Many Naga women pursuing different careers have been trendsetters even outshining their male counterparts in some professions. However, they are still yet to break the glass ceiling when it comes to the construction industry. According to data furnished to this news agency by the Employment Skill Development and Entrepreneurship Department, as many as 559 persons including 531 males and 28 females from 11 districts were trained under the initiative. NSCN IM stresses truth in historical connections. The NSCN IM on Sunday acknowledged that the Naga, Methi and Kuki communities have historical connection However, Naga people should not be misled by propaganda aimed at diluting the Naga national identity as parties may use this historical connection to advance their own interests, it said. In a press release, the NSN IM referred to the recent issue of brotherhood between the Tangul and Methi communities and emphasized that the narrative is primarily associated with the Hundung village royal family and a few Methi clans in the Himpal valley and it does not represent the entire Thangul community. That's all for now. To guess the status, don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you.